Okay, we're starting day three. That's your weekend homework, day three of Magpie. Uh, the directions there on day three. Let's pull mine up real fast. My day three directions. Uh, here we are. Uh, says to import the uh, day three, activity three files. We don't usually import stuff. We just drag it into BlueJay. But if you go to your activity three folder, just, just highlight it right there. And hit import, it'll bring in the files that are in day three. Okay. Uh, in day three is a discussion of two lower case, something that's not on your quick reference for the AP exam, but obviously the College Board, the AP exam people made this lab for us, and they put two lower case in there uh, just to show you how it works. So let's play with it a little bit here. Let's go. Uh, String word equals A, B, C, D, E. So I've got three uppercase letters and two lowercase letters. And if I go uh, system.out.println, uh, original, and display it, of course. I'm going to see exactly what's on in the word there of it initially. Compile it. Now, if I go system.out.println, word.toLowerCase, okay. it'll change all the uppercase letters to lowercase. Okay, this looks really easy, but I know there's a misconception here for some kids, so please hang with me. Uh, so there it is, all lowercase a, b, c, d, e. Okay, no problem. And then here's the misconception. Kids think maybe that the word itself is changed, but when I display word, it's back to the original. So word never got changed. See, it's back to the original. Word is still capital A, capital C, capital E. Because two lowercase returns the new word. And you got to store it in your variable. So we'd have to do it this way if we really wanted to change if you really wanted to change what was inside the word. Okay, so make sure you understand how two lowercase works. Don't go too fast on this. It's just one little method to figure out. Then you're off to the races. So there it is, all lowercase. Make sure you understand that first. 